Happy 500th to Tiba and a nice win to celebrate. Thank you. Yeah, it's good. Um, just um, a little adjustment to the starting five today and it seemed to pay dividends with a great defensive display. Yeah, I think, um, you know, something I was, was uh, flirting with for a long time uh, since the cup competition and uh, when Jeremy came in, I thought, let me see what it looks like with the previous one, but I thought it would just need a little bit of a shake up and um, yeah, it paid off today, but I think we, we have a team that different people can start at different times. You managed to get early minutes for Joe Campbell uh, today and he was a big contributing factor in a big 45-27 half-time lead. Yeah, he's um, you know, a very talented younger player. Um, you know, he's a hard worker, um, very coachable. So I'm glad to see him come out here and, and have a good game and hopefully build confidence in what he can do for the, for the, for the season. Um, sorry, tried to regain their discipline in the third quarter, but Jeremy Hemsley came up big in that quarter. Um, the shot's taking it by 30 points to 20 overall. Yeah, um, Jeremy's, you know, very, very uh, dynam dynamic point guard and he's able to make some, some key points when they started to make a little run and get some um, momentum going with that, that younger group they put out. So, you know, it's important to have that at your point guard and I think he displayed that now in the last couple games. Sorry, normally known for being a high scoring team, so to hold them to 61 points, quite an achievement. Yeah, I think, um, you know, we, we, we did a good job. They played last night, so we came out with a lot of energy, intensity, jumped out on them. And, uh, you know, we built that lead. We did a great job of responding whenever they tried to make a run. Uh, and some big, big performances today. Um, just mentioned Jeremy Hemsley, 21 points, three rebounds and an assist. I mean, yeah, I mean, for the limited minutes, I think he played 22 minutes, just under 23. Um, that's a lot of points, uh, very effective. And, um, you know, he's just, he's someone, I, as, you, as we were going, you can see the team trust him, and that's what we need. Uh, and we've also already spoken about Joe Campbell, 21 points, seven rebounds and an assist again. Yeah, again, um, he needs to keep building his confidence. You know, he's very early in his career, and I uh, think um, he displayed what he can do. Now it's about doing it consistently and, and when teams are keen on you. Uh, you were able to sit him quite early, but Antoine Lillard with 25 points, nine rebounds and assists, just one off a double-double. Yeah, Antoine's been, you know, he's been one of our main scorers so far this season. Very physical uh, guard wing player, and uh, when he gets around that basket, you know, good things happen. And you're straight back into action tomorrow night away at Leicester. Uh, I know it's a dead rubber for the Sharks, but how will you approach that game? I think there's some things we need to work on. I think we need to um, kind of uh, kind of sharpen up some of our offenses and uh, defensive schemes. So I think it'll be good for that and, and letting guys um, just get a good game in against a very high quality, high caliber team. I know they have some new players in and they'll want to keep winning ways or two. So I expect it to be quite competitive. And uh, you, you play the same team again next Friday. Do you think that game will be any different to tomorrow night? Um, <laughs> it's hard to say. I, doubt, I think it's going to be, they're going to they're be competitive. I think, you know, both clubs, you know, we, we compete and they compete and it uh, won't be any difference no matter what the situation or circumstance. Uh, right, another, on to today's big um, main theme. Um, how does it feel to reach the 500 games <laughs> coached work, uh, Mark? Um, uh, the youngest to do so and all with one club. I mean, it feels it feels great, you know. I think, uh, you know, doing anything and having success is great, but longevity is kind of the kind of really the pat on the back of doing a good job when they trust you for a long time and and coach as many players I have now over the years, and it's been really satisfying and it's uh, something I hope to do five more of. Uh, can you pick out a particularly memorable game or two if you're able to? Um, well, it's always the probably the first cup was the probably most memorable because it was our first. Um, championship beneath my home when I was still playing and it was uh, in my second year coaching so it kind of gave me a lot of confidence moving forward. And what about your ambitions from game 501 onwards? <laughs> Hopefully go uh, undefeated for the next 500. <laughs> <laughs> Atiba, thank you. A great many congratulations on Cheers. today and thank you. Great performance. Thanks a lot.